the former LRA commander Thomas Coelho, was brought to court by 8 a.m. <laughs> Koyelo is charged with several crimes against humanity, like rape, torture, and murder, among others. The absence of an interpreter delayed the beginning of the court proceedings by several hours. During the proceedings, the defense lawyers expressed concern over the poor feeding of their client. Hey, that this court being international should see to that it, it takes a breakfast, a break tea, lunch, and evening tea. Suppose the prisoner is supposed to eat three meals a day. Three meals. Ah, yes, sir. 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 We also understand that the prison authorities already have a list of who can visit the accused. In the case they bring him food, then the authorities will know who to allow to give that food to the accused person. Justice Gaswaga ordered the prosecution lawyers to avail all the needed evidence in the case before the end of this week. Counsel, we urge you to do that this week. Ensure that all disclosure is done. According to his lawyers, Coelho doesn't fully understand all charges against him since there was no translation of such. <laughs> In fact, we had even objected before the pretrial judge when the charges were confirmed, when he didn't know what was against him. The lawyers of the victims, some of whom will also be witnesses, requested for a special budget to cater for these people. Lord, for us, the prosecution has a very good intention of uh, helping out on witnesses who might also be victims. This court and the, perhaps the, the judiciary and those who frame the rules realize that these vic victims and witnesses have unique or peculiar characteristics. So to rely entirely on the prosecution for the uh, interest of the victims will not be proper. It is expected that Coelho will take plea in tomorrow's session when all the charges will be read to him. Ali Mivole, NTV, Guru.